Hi everyone, I'm Tony Mori. I'm visiting Claude Val in the Stag's Leap district today. Let's visit together. Situated in the Stag's Leap district of Napa, Claude Val was established by American businessman John Goelet with the purchase of 150 acres of land in 1972. He based this purchase on the words of French winemaker Bernard Portet, who said, this area is perfect for growing grapes. Claude Val, which means a small vineyard in a small valley, strives to create estate-style wine by using Napa Valley grapes and traditional European techniques. We have John Clouse with us. He's vice president and winemaker at Claude Val. Yes, Claude Val is one of the older wineries in Napa Valley. Uh, today there are 400 wineries here. And um, Claude Val was winery number 38 after Prohibition. And it was founded by a Frenchman. And uh, he was given the task to find a vineyard in which to grow high quality Cabernet and Merlot to compete with uh, wines of, of Europe and, and of the rest of the world. And, he chose this site right here in Stags Leap District and in 1972 and started building the winery and the first year, the first wine we made was a 1972 Cabernet Sauvignon. Um, one year later, the, um, the, the owner of the winery came and asked where uh, uh, the Burg Burgundy varieties would be planted. So we had the, the, the Bordeaux varieties, the Cabernet and Merlot were planted in Stags Leap. Anyway, the, um, Young winemaker Bernard Portet then decided that if he could plant, if he could grow good Cabernet here, that he needed to find a different site to grow Chardonnay and Pinot Noir, and and he thought a cooler site would be, be more appropriate. So he travelled south down towards the San Pablo Bay, and in the Canaros region in 1973 he bought uh, 180 acres uh, to grow our uh, Burgundy varieties, so the Chardonnay and the Pinot Noir. Um, that was all back in 72 and 73. Today. In 2009, we've had our 38 harvest and continue to specialize with, with Cabernet uh, from Stags Leap District and Chardonnay and Pinot Noir from the Canaros area. I think that wines are, uh, should be designed to go well with food. And Clodeval um, was established with a, a Euro European idea in mind and wine and food go, go together. And in order to go well with food, uh, a wine needs a sense of balance. Um, by that I mean that if the wine is too strong flavored, if, if it has too much alcohol or too much wood or too much tannin, too much acid, it's, it's unbalanced and it'll be more difficult to pair with, with a, a wide variety of foods. I think a wine, be it Chardonnay or Cabernet, uh, made with a sense of balance has more versatility and can go with a, a wider range of foods. We, we want the varietal character to be very strong. We also do not like to add acid or to manipulate the wines very much, so we, we like natural acidity. Because of that, we'll pick a little earlier than, than some people. Um, and alcohol is very important too. We, don't, we need some alcohol, it gives you richness, but you, you don't want too much because it becomes overpowering um, and, um, and, and also uh, it, it creates a burning sensation at the end of the, end of the mouth. Um, today we'll be tasting two wines. Um, this is the, the Chardonnay 2007 from Canaros. Um, and this is our flagship. It's the Stags Leap District Cabernet uh, 2005. Uh, state bottled from our vineyards right around the winery here, uh, Stags Leap. Um, the Chardonnay is barrel fermented. We're trying to make wines like the Great White uh, Burgundies. Um, that have been barrel fermented for thousands of years. And the idea is to produce um, a full flavored wine with the richness that you get from small barrel fermentations, but still with high natural acidity to give you a balance in the mouth um, with alcohol imbalance. And uh, so rich flavors, but still elegant. Uh, the Cabernet is a blend of Cabernet Merlot, Cabernet Franc. and. Uh, it's made very much in the style of, of the great Bordeaux. And the wine is fermented in steel and then aged in, in barrels for two years. And again, it's, it's designed to be a full-bodied, a rich wine, one that will age for 20 or 30 years if you have a cellar to, to age it in. Um, but is 
is rich, uh, still elegant, has the tannin, uh, the acid, the alcohol all is in check. It's uh, aged in 50% uh, new barrels, but the wine has so much flavor that uh, you don't really notice the oak very much. Um, so again, a, a wine that's, that's, that's full, but, but still elegant. So when you come to Napa Valley, be sure to visit Clodeval and taste our lovely wines and look for our wines also in, in your favorite restaurant in, at home because we are distribu distributed well in, in Japan and, and the Far East. So thank you very much and please come to Clodeval. How did you like Clodeval? I hope you enjoyed it. Okay, I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>